Hey, gringo! Mr. Ricketts, come on in. Sit down and have yourself a drink. Sure. Say, any word of Javier Escuela? Uh, no, nothing yet. Say, why are you after him anyway? We're old friends. We was kind of educated together. <laughs> so what is this, some kind of high school reunion sort of thing? Something like that. Well, well, you've killed people. You live the life. <sighs> that I have. And I tried to stop. I mean, I don't know. I tried to go straight. I did. I left the gang after the gang left me. Left me to die after I'd been shot. They'd all gone crazy anyhow. Our old leader? A fella you probably heard of. Anyway, he more or less lost his mind, went and shot a bunch of people unfair like. I got shot in a robbery. They left me, and I left them. <laughs> well, that's how it goes. <laughs> <clears throat> Already had me a woman, got me a farm, then I got me more trouble. Sure. <laughs> I've been sent to track down the men I used to run with. Track them, kill them. Well, if you don't, someone else will. There's no escape. Look at me, I spent 25 years killing men. <laughs> Look at me now, sitting around here like some low-rent would-be messiah. <laughs> We're relics. Come on, have yourself another drink, and let's wallow in a little self-pity. Sounds like a plan. Your health. Mr. Ricketts, Mr. Ricketts, thank the Lord I have found you. And you, Mr. Marston. Will you sit down? You all right? I'm well, sir. But Allende is sending more men to the death. Prisoners who have not been tried. A prominent writer, Castilla, and a local official whose only crime was not putting the small holders on the street when they were late with taxes. Writers and government officials. For once, I agree with Allende. Some men need to be killed. Mr. Ricketts! No, I was just joking. Where are they? Out near Escalera. Let's hang up our self-pity and go shoot ourselves some bad guys. You're gonna be all right. Thank you. Both of you. Buenas. Let's head for Escalera. Get up! Yeah! Luisa was pretty shaken up. She's angry. This war is getting dirtier by the day. People are being executed for just having an opinion. Linda seems to have more enemies by the day. Perhaps you would know. Rumor has it you've been making all kinds of new friends. I don't pay much attention to rumors. Just be careful, John. Keep jumping from one side of the fence to the other. You might just get impaled on it. I have to find these two men. With respect, how I do it is no concern of yours. Choose your tone wisely, partner. Remember who you're talking to. How could I ever forget? And who are you, John Marston? Apart from a rat feeding every other hand he can find, my name means something. All you've done is kill a few peasants, and the only real outlaw you've taken on dropped you like a bad habit. Now, I'd politely ask you to watch your tone, Rick. All I'm saying is, maybe there's a reason why people around here don't want to talk. You must miss your family. It's the only thing that keeps me going. You know, you remind me a lot of myself. How I used to be. Stubborn and angry. You ain't changed all that much. I always thought I'd lived a charm life. I've known... Look! It's an army convoy. I think I see the prisoners in those wagons. Come on! See if you can take control of that first wagon. What am I doing here?
I will handle it from here. I know you got other matters to attend to. It's been nice riding with you, Mr. Ricketts. <laughs> and you too. You took me back to another time. Talk to Louisa. She'll help you, and she's well connected in that other land. I hope you find what you're looking for, Marston. You know what I'm looking for. <laughs> if you say so, Marston. If you say so. Mr. Marston, ride with us. We've been betrayed. What's happened? If there's no time, ride with us. Then we'll find the men you seek. Come. There's a combo waiting for us. Come, we must hurry. What's the hurry, DeSanta? Where are we going? The rebels have taken control of an abandoned fort on the other side of Nuevo Paraíso. Many men. A place called Torquemada. We can allow them to establish a stronghold. The Coronel has given me urgent orders. Which are? To kill them all. I should have guessed. Leave your horse here. You will ride with me. Los rebeldes tienen una fortaleza ahora. ¿A dónde vamos a parar? Abraham Reyes tiene un verdadero ejército. Dicen que hay cientos de hombres apostados a Torquemada. Creo que somos muy pocos. Captain Espinosa has set a cap at the base of the mesa. We will join forces with him there. Arston, wake up. We're almost there. Stay alert. Something doesn't feel right. Rebels! Hold them off! We're not far from... You fight like chicas! Behind us! Kill those cabrones! Let's see what... 
what mess that idiot Espinosa has made. Is he that deranged captain at Tesoro Azul? Is he leading this attack? Me? Espinosa does not lead anything. I thought you was the same rank. He is an angry dog we let out to run sometimes. That is all. I'm in charge here. Follow me. We will leave the wagon here. Ignore the stupid aim. Shut your mouth off his boy! Gringo! Take that sniper rifle over there. We have many work to do. now. Move forward into the valley. Bagoso. Para Gloria. me, pal. Just run off home. The valley is clear. Adelante, Cuevan. Forward. You are no use back there. Kill the snipers! Vamos, idiotas! Vamos! Next one. 
pleasure doing business with you, boys. Vamos! Cargamos colina arriba! Vamos! No podemos fallar! Oh, who's up, you boss? I keep getting mad! You want to die, mister? You ain't well, boss! Chuck! That's enough, my friend! No, ten que piedad con ellos! Amigo, amigo, ¿qué pasa? Uh, 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 Killer like you uh, deserves fine women and wine. The best pleasures earth can give a man. I need some information, De Santa. All in good time. Uh, my man and I will finish our business here, and we can talk back at Escalera. The next time I see you, I need some answers, Captain. <laughs> Go get drunk, get a woman! Enjoy life! It's a beautiful struggle! <laughs>
¿Cómo está usted? ¿Cómo está usted? ¡Ándeles, lindas sin patrióticas! ¡Dale, que ustedes son putas y lo saben! ¡Por favor! ¡No me hablas! Oh, mi amor, nadie te está obligando a hacer nada. Solamente quiero que animes al hombre que va a salvar a tu padre. ¿Tú quieres a tu padre, cierto que sí, linda? ¿Qué está pasando aquí, Captain de Santa? Just a little recruitment. Nothing for you to be concerned about. You boys using women soldiers now? Our customs are none of your concern. Apparently not. Santo mariconcito, me encontraste algunas chicas. Ay, mamacita, ¿dónde has estado toda mi vida? Ven, ven, mujeres. Ay, me gusta. It's too patriots working to make your acquaintance, ah, el coronel. Fantastic. I love patriots. Ah, hey, Sanka Marston, you here to fight the war? And we shall make a patriot of you yet. I hope so. Any word of those men? Oh, yes. I heard they were riding with Reyes. I wanted to talk to you about it. Uh, the Santo, uh, hable con él. Tell him what I wanted. Huh? <laughs> His Excellency, el Coronel, would like to employ you in escorting a train down rebel country. The job is dangerous. But you'll have the honor of... <laughs> Another patriot? Of knowing that you serve Mexico in her fight against forces <laughs> that would destroy our society. How much you offer? 20,000 pesos. And information as to the whereabouts of Javier Escuella. Okay, then. Mexico loves you, Mr. Martin. She has a funny way of showing it. Bob, gringo, ride with us. Listening to me, does it seem quiet to you? I don't know. You tell me. We have not seen a single rebel yet. I'd say that's a good thing, wouldn't you? He's spotted! Rebeldes! Matenlos! see any more of them. That is close. I don't know. This doesn't feel right to me. We're on our way to escort a train through rebel-held country. An ambush feels about right to me. Soldado! ¿Quién eres? ¿Cuál escuadrón? Somos nuevos reclutas, Capitán. Es nuestra primera asignación. I knew I had not seen these men before. They are new recruits. In Escalera, people have been talking about the rebels planning a large attack. If these supplies are so important, why have we been given so few soldiers? Don't ask me. You're the captain. I thought you were supposed to be fearless. I am fearless, but not brainless. There is something wrong. I feel it. Maybe you just need to take a piss or something. The colonel told me that the Santa had praised my actions at Torquemada and called me a hero. He asked for me to be given this important assignment. Why would he do that? The cabrón hates me! Yeah, but doesn't everybody hate you? Maybe we should turn back or wait for reinforcements. If Felinde says he knows where Javier Escuela is, we're doing what he asks. I thought you obeyed orders. I don't like being lied to. Another ambush! Ain't no need to die, friend! 
on schedule. At least one thing is going right for us. I agree. We ain't off to a good start. You shoot well, gringo. Tell me something. What is your weapon of choice? What do you mean? Come, my friend. Your belt is full of weapons. Which is your favorite for attacking a man? You ain't right in the head, Captain. Do you want to know what mine is? Not particularly. Truth. We are close to Chuparrosa now. I still have a bad feeling about this. Tell me, why are you here? What did they promise you? 20,000 pesos in Javier Escuela. That is a lot of promises. Do you know where Escuela is? You think I am going to tell you that before you have fulfilled your obligations? Do not take me for a fool. I've given you no reason not to trust me. You must understand why we are suspicious of you. Most American vigilantes come here to help the rebels. It is strange you have chosen to work for the army. I'm not working for you. How many times do I have to say this? Call it what you want, gringo. We are exchanging favors then. I ain't seen many favors come my way yet. Abraham Reyes is trying hard to recruit gringos to fight for him. His propaganda is everywhere. He promises women, gold, and... Of course you go. Money and the chance to interfere in business that is not your own. How can any American resist? I've done everything you've asked of me. If Alinde doesn't give me a squela in Williamson after this, I think it's best I go ask the rebels directly. Is that the threat? Be warned. You are only alive right now because of me. Can you be advised? I don't answer to you, Captain. I have orders to kill you the moment you step out of line. Here we are, at last. Colados, abordamos el tren. I do not think we have seen the last of the rebels. You recruits can't win a fight like this. I need you to man the Gatling gun. I ain't the soldier here, Captain. Do not question me, gringo. Just do as I say. Take your position now! I hope you know how to use that gun. Can't be that hard. Just point and pull the trigger. Por Dios! We will all be killed! Don't worry, Captain. I've used one of these before. For a cold-hearted killer, you're an anxious son of a bitch, ain't you? We have already been ambushed. Our squad is made up of new recruits and the two men that Santa hates the most. I think it is right to be anxious. Yeah, well, I wasn't exactly expecting a pleasant picnic by the seaside myself.
I think that's all of it. We do not have far to go. The base camp is just at the top of the hill. That was madness. You did well, compadre. Very well. Whatever I get they promise you in return, you have earned it. I don't think the Santa expected us to come back from this. Did you want to kill him, or should I? No. Until I find a squala, he's more used to me a lot. Senor Marston, thank you for your efforts. The escort was a success. At least some of your men survived. I didn't think to survive myself. My whole life I have dreamed of a glorious death. <laughs> Vamos! Rapido antes uh, que nos ataquen otra vez. These socialist pigs cannot be allowed to win. 